All right, so yeah, so we have approximately um, 60 plus thousand devices in the district. Uh, and that includes the Chromebooks, it includes Windows devices, uh, it includes iPads. I do believe that it's essential that students get their same device back year after year after year because it does um, bring forward good stewardship of that device. We wanted to build in responsibility and accountability here. So uh, for the kids keeping the same device year over year was part of the responsibility piece of this. Because it's theirs and we're telling them this is your responsibility, this is your textbook, this is your notebook, this is part of your learning, this is what is empowering you and your learning in school. Keep up with it. So Incident IQ has, for us, uh, has been a great, a great piece of software. When we collected a device, we logged within the system which slot that device went into. Again, it, when you first heard it, it was like, that's a crazy plan. You know, for us to be able to assign those um, devices in storage to a particular slot for that student in a particular box. And then next year, they're gonna get that same box back in the school and I'm gonna scan a card and it's gonna tell me exactly which box that student's device is located in and which slot in that box. That can't ever happen. However, it did. Uh, and we were able to do that without creating long lines when we, when we redistributed. Again, we probably had a few skeptics out there, but once they saw it in action, we came back to the principal's meeting um, at the beginning of the, of the school year principal was like, okay, it really worked. And everybody was very pleased about how smoothly all of that went. The check-in, check-out, um, end of life, the whole cycle is handled within the Incident IQ. Very intuitive product. Students, uh, about 30 second transaction per, per child came in, received their device. It was automatically assigned within the asset management program. And we had no problems with that. Um, to this day, we still track the same device from the initial implementation, and we're very proud of that.